Hello everyone, you're watching College Review Series by Akash. Welcome to the in-depth review of IIT Goa today. Yes, IIT Goa, one of the India's newest IITs. For sure, the IIT is rapidly growing with its focus on research and innovation. But how exactly is the IIT performing compared to the older IITs? What are its strengths and challenges? So let's dive deep in and explore the reality of IIT Goa, its academics, placements, fee structures, scholarships, and future prospects. IIT Goa is a public technical and research university which was established by the Ministry of Human Resource and Development, Government of India in 2016. While the plans for the permanent campus are still underway, the IIT is operating from its temporary campus which is located within the Goa Engineering College GCE at Farmagudi, Ponda. So this interim setup is totally equipped with all the essential facilities to provide academic and extracurricular activities. So so the essential facilities provided here are classroom and laboratories, seminar halls, a central library, hostels, dining halls, sports and fitness, medical center and banking services. Talking about the courses offered here at IIT Goa. So the IIT offers various undergraduate and postgraduate programs in different fields such as technologies, sciences, humanities and engineering. So the various undergraduate programs offered here are in the fields of computer science and engineering, electrical engineering, mechanical engineering, and mathematics and computing. And to get admission in one of these courses, the eligibility criteria is same at all the IITs. As the students seeking admission in one of the BTEC courses need to pass class 12 board examination with physics, chemistry, and mathematics with 75% aggregate if you are a general category of the student, whereas you need to score at least 65% if you belong to STSC or PWD category. Further, the students must clear J advanced once in order to be eligible for the admission process and for that you must first clear j -Main paper one and foreign students need not to appear for j -Main paper one they can straight away register themselves for j at once thereafter you sit for josa counseling based on the mark secured in your j advance then you get all your documents verified and paid up required fees and for foreign nationals they get accepted through dasa direct admission of students abroad or iccr schemes Talking about the fee structure now. So the one-time fee payable, which is at the time of admission, is five thousand rupees. Per semester fee is one lakh fourteen thousand seven hundred and fifty, including various charges. Then the security deposit is three thousand, which is refundable. In addition to this, every student is required to pay a per semester mess advance of eighteen thousand and a refundable mess advance of two thousand at the time of admission. So all in all, the entire cost for your four years of BTEC from IIT Goa will lie somewhere between 10 to 11 lakh. Like all the IITs, IIT Goa also provides certain fee waivers to its economically weaker section students. Like students from STSU or PWD category, they get full remission of tuition fee. Again, 100% tuition fee remission to all the general or OBC candidates with family income less than 1 lakh rupees. Whereas the candidates with parental income between 1 to 5 lakh, they get two thirds of the remission of tuition fee. In addition to this, there are certain scholarship schemes offered by the IIT. Merit come means scholarship where a monthly stipend of 1000 rupees is provided to the students for a maximum of 4 months per semester or 8 per academic year. The second scholarship is free messing where the facilities of free messing is granted to eligible scheduled caste or scheduled tribe students with parental income less than 4.5 lakh. So under this scheme, a monthly stipend of 250 rupees for a maximum of four months per semester is provided to the students. Along with this, the IT also accept external scholarships from different aids such as from National Scholarship Portal. So in order to get complete description of the scholarship programs, the eligibility criteria and the deadlines, do visit the official website. Talking about the placements now. 
तो आए थे गोवा हैज कंसिस्टेंटली डिमॉन्स्ट्रेटेड अ स्ट्रॉन्ग प्लेसमेंट परफॉर्मेंस लाइक इन द ईयर ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर प्लेसमेंट सेशन द इंस्टीट्यूट अचीव एन ओवरऑल प्लेसमेंट रेट ऑफ नाइन्टी पॉइंट सिक्स विद हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी वन कंपनीज पार्टिसिपेटिंग इन द प्लेसमेंट ड्राइव सो टॉकिंग पर्टिकुलरली अबाउट द बी टेक प्लेसमेंट हाईलाइट दैन द हाइएस्ट सैलरी पैकेज ऑफर्ड वॉज सिक्सटी लैक पर एन एम विद एवरेज पैकेज टूड एट फिफ्टीन पॉइंट नाइन टू एल पी ए with median package as 13 lakh lpa for the talking about mtech placement highlights then the average package offered was 11.72 lakh per annum and median package was 8 lakh per annum notably six students secured international offers from companies such as accenture japan and willing japan it is the branch wise placement data followed by the recruiters who participated in the placement drive and also offered full time jobs now let's find out how tough is it to get into iit goa as compared to other iits cut off 2024 25 here is the branch wise je advance rank cut off for the year 2024 after fifth round of josa counseling for computer science and engineering branch the rank cut off for gender neutral started at 4070 and closed at 5371 for the female only category the rank started at 10256 and closed at 11151 For electrical engineering now for general neutral candidates the opening rank stood at 7765 and the closing rank was 9603 for the female only category the same started at 15164 and closed at 16560 for mathematics and computing branch the opening rank was 4928 and the closing was 6685 for gender neutral and for the female only category the same Same started at twelve thousand five hundred and fifteen and closed at thirteen thousand three hundred and eighty one. For mechanical engineering, the rank for general neutral category closed at twelve thousand and sixty six, and for the female only category, the same closed at twenty thousand fifty four. For more information on IIT Goa cut off twenty twenty four, do visit the link given in the description. So, in a nutshell, it won't be wrong to say that IIT Goa has quickly established itself as a strong contender among the newly established IITs. with all thanks to its high placement rates competitive salary packages and strong recruiter network that despite being operating from a temporary campus the institute has maintained a strong academic standard so when compared to its counterparts such as iit bilai iit dharwad and iit jammu iit goa for sure outshines in placements with top companies such as google microsoft and amazon recruiting the students with attractive salary packages So if you are prioritizing high paid salary jobs along with global exposure then IIT Goa is certainly going to be an excellent choice for you and with this i leave the decision on you as this was all from me today once again you let me know which other iit or which other college do you want me to review next and don't forget to press the like and subscribe button so you do not miss out on any updates for more such informative content stay connected